Hey guys, I hit the road last night after work, uh, heading back home uh, to the Hampton Roads area of Virginia, my old stomping grounds. I'm not going to say exactly where I'm going. Uh, my buddy John Blair is somewhere a couple hours back behind me. Uh, I did a little bit of car camping last night at a uh, undisclosed Walmart. Uh, again, that's why I've got this Honda Pilot set up the way that I do. I can just, I can basically live out of this thing. It's great. Uh, but uh, we're going to get down, um, maybe go for some crappy, some uh, perch, and uh, a few largemouth. So here's to a, a beautiful day on the water, a nice trip. The weather's great. Uh, we had some colder weather this uh, this week, but now it's, uh, I don't know, it's 8.23 in the morning and it's 60 degrees already. As I was driving down last night, I saw the temperature steadily go up. So we're looking at some really good conditions. We're going to be fishing some uh, tidal swampy water, uh, but again, we're not going to tell you exactly where it is. So stay tuned and see you. Uh, if we get skunked. So you know the old saying, the bigger the bait, the bigger the fish? Well, it goes for crappy too. What am I doing today? I've upgraded the size here. This one actually is like a, you know, two to three inch uh, gulp grub. And I've actually got it kind of hooked in there on the jig head uh, weedlessly. But uh, I haven't caught any dink so far. They've all been really nice size crappy. So that goes not just for bass, but also for crappy upsize your grubs, upsize your presentation, and there's a good chance you'll catch a bigger fish and you won't catch all those little dinks. So, I'm about halfway through the day, mostly throwing grubs, pretty large ones at that too, and some gulp grubs. Having some good luck, not a lot of bass, the bass I've been catching too, the largemouth, have been pretty small in size, but uh, catching a lot of really nice crappie. And, John Blair is not even here yet. Still has to get his license, and he's about an hour out. It sounded like normal and they're all like, yo, why why y'all go down there getting their gear ready without getting food? What time is it? Too late. What time are you supposed to be here? <laughs> hey, I had no I had no time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
John Blair is here. So John made it, and we're going back. I've got my second wind. Let's see if we can uh, get more fish. So the tide's almost all the way out. It's almost still low tide. The bite's totally turned off. As soon as the, you know, the tide started slowing down on the outgoing, they have no luck whatsoever. And of course now John's here too. So he's still back there trying to find his first fish. Should have been here earlier. Let me see him. Beast. John's first bluegill of the day. Big crappy dude, nice. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Nice. Hey John, what you got? Bowfin. Hold that puppy up. Is that, is that a citation, John? Oh, it's close. Let's get a measurement on it. That's sweet. What'd you catch it on? Gaunt minnow. Nice. Nice one. Beautiful fish. In kind of an ugly way. <laughs> nice. Well, it's getting dark. Caught a lot of fish. 
super low tide. Let's see how John does with the obstacles. I barely made this one myself. You can do it! Yeah, there's our workout. So it's Sunday morning. Uh, John and I are back up. <sighs> Slept in a little bit. We were totally wiped out yesterday. Uh, we're gonna go look to go hit the water somewhere and catch up hopefully with some of my old friends from the Williamsburg Kayak Fishing Association. Old school get together of WKFA. Where are we? We're at um, Ed Allen's campground. So right beside Rockahawk. And that's all you get. There's Did you bring a shucker or? Oh, look, you brought a red shucker. That's awesome. <laughs> Here's the other shuckers. So we're heading back up north. Uh, done with our fishing for the weekend. John Blair is behind me in his Jeep. Uh, had a good week. Uh, Today wasn't that great. A cold front came in. It's starting to rain now. Yesterday on Saturday was hot. I mean, I got sunburned pretty bad. But uh, now I'm looking here at 65, but it's overcast and dreary. But uh, fish kind of turned off. It, it was kind of odd. I did catch one uh, decent bass today. I uh, caught it on a big road runner type of lure. It was actually out away from shore. There was stuff that looked like little bluegills and stuff starting to get on bed. but. Off the shore, what in the lake? Not a whole lot. But I uh, got to hang out with our old buddies from the Williamsburg Kayak Fishing Association. Be sure to check them out on Facebook. Uh, and then we had a nice little get together after the fact. But uh, had a blast. Glad John got down here. Did a lot yesterday on the, on the creek. But well, we're back into spring. Should only be getting better from here on out. Thanks for watching fishyacker.com. As we always ask you, be sure to subscribe to the Fish Yacker YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and we'll catch you on the water. FishYacker.com, the original kayak rigging video series.